The Game Developers Conference is wrapping up. Renee San Miguel sits down with the CEO of one of this year's hottest online game companies. Coming up, this is Headline News. Keep it here. Well, guess what? The multi-billion dollar video game industry now rivals Hollywood in terms of revenue. But while Hollywood prepares for the Oscars, the gaming industry is wrapping up one of its big annual events, the Game Developers Conference. Renee San Miguel is joined now by a big name attending that conference. Renee. Thank you, Sophia. For hardcore Silicon Valley geeks, the big event in San Jose, California, believe it or not, is not basketball this weekend, but it's the Game Developers Conference. And one of the big names there is Andre Bakken. He's the CEO of Funcom, the company that created PC Gamer Magazine's massively multiplayer game of the year, Anarchy Online. Mr. Bakken, thanks for joining us. Hello, Rene. Thank you for coming online with you. No, no, no problem there. How do you feel about the PC Gamer Magazine Award, considering that Anarchy Online uh, took a little while to get to find its audience? For us to get the PC Game uh, Prize was uh, amazing. Uh, we are a small game company based out of Norway, and uh, to win such a prize in competition with uh, Sony and Microsoft, that is, uh, that is huge for us. On online gaming is the next big trend that everybody's talking about in the industry. What are you hearing about online gaming, or what have you heard, at the Game Developers Conference? At the Game, De Ge <coughs> Sorry. At the game Developers Conference, there has been uh, much more focus on online games this year compared to last year. I would say there was at least 30 to 40 percent of the, the shows or, or speaks uh, at the show that has been talking about online games. What so this is uh, definitely taking on. Uh, and what, what do the companies that make online games need to do to really widen the audience? What, what do they need to do in terms of education about, about broadband and things like that? Or just, you know, the kind of systems they need to, uh, to play these games? Uh, people don't really need broadband to play uh, online games today. Uh, broadband is good for distribution, but uh, you need a fairly powerful computer and uh, you need um, a method to pay on the internet. Basically, that means credit cards today. Okay, we got about 45 seconds left. Sony and Microsoft are getting into the online gaming space with their gaming consoles. Is this competition, or will you provide versions of Anarchy Online for the uh, Xbox and the PlayStation 2? Uh, we will be developing uh, games for both Xbox and PlayStation 2 as soon as those games platforms are ready to go online and, and have a, a full-fledged business model online. Okay. Absolutely. Their strategies are, they're working on them, so we'll see what happens. Andre Bakken, CEO of Funcom, joining us from San Jose at the site of the Game Developers Conference. Thanks for your time and congratulations on the PC Gamer Magazine Award. Thank you, Renee. That is Hotwired for this hour. Now here's tonight's Smart Medicine.